I'm out of town right now, but I thought I'd do what I eat in a day and try to stick to as much plant-based as possible, but eating away from home. And what does that look like? Stay tuned. How do you go on vacation without gaining the extra weight? I know a lot of this can be water retention. I get that but we want to be able to still wear our clothes and to feel good and not to have that bloated feeling. But really, it's very important to stay hydrated and drink lots of water in between if you're having any libations or, you know what I mean, cocktails or something. Make sure you're hydrated, drink before and drink after you actually have any alcohol. Also with the foods, you know there's it's very rich. You can't necessarily control what's put into your foods, but you can find vegetarian, vegan, plant-based options that will work on most menus in a lot of the restaurants. Here in Scottsdale, it is definitely uh, such a breath of fresh air to see menus that are having those options. And that's what I'm finding out. So, and then also I'm taking two meals, two mad, and I'm eating two meals a day because I wanna make sure that I am spending time with my love and also to make sure that I feel semi-normal than my normal regimen when I'm at home. I think that you can still either maintain your weight or even lose a little bit if you're doing the right things and making the right food choices. When is the right time to take off from your regimen of doing either OMAD or one meal a day or doing intermittent fasting like your 16-8 or 18-6 or your 24? So what is a good time to just take a break? It is always good to take those small breaks in between long-term intermittent fasting schedules because we tend to go to a plateau. And when a plateau happens, it's frustrating, right? And when we have all this extra rate we may have gained over the past year with the lockdowns and such, this is the time to really take a look at what your new intermittent schedule should be or what you need to tweak in the schedule that will give your body a jolt to get it back on track to start burning the fat off on a regular basis. So me being away from home gives me the opportunity to just rest, enjoy eating multiple times a day, but try to eat the right things. And it doesn't mean that you have to be so strict. And as you guys know, I am definitely plant-based, mostly. And that's about 90% of the time. But on this trip, I have been eating some forms of meat or, you know, fish. And that's still meat, but 
I'm being very careful to add in plenty of vegetables, more greens, uh, even soups of sorts. Tomato basil soup I've had, I've had black bean soup, so delicious. Now, I know you can't control what everyone puts into those ingredients that could be what we consider non-plant-based or non-vegan, but hey, give yourself a break for once, right? And if you're okay with that, then just enjoy. And when you sleep well, in which I've been sleeping pretty well in this room, I mean, you know, check it out. It's pretty cool, right? I've been sleeping pretty good. And I can tell you, that helps you lose weight as well. So longevity and sleeping, sleeping more than seven hours a night. Also quality sleep, getting in the REM stage of sleep, that fourth stage of sleep where you really are deep sleeping because that's when the body heals itself. That's when it also burns more fat in those extra calories that you may have not thought about that you're eating probably a lot more than you would eat when you're at home. So. But with the sleeping, I noticed that my belly has gotten a lot flatter and uh, the bloating has gone down quite a bit when I'm drinking more water. And of course I need to do that today is drink more water. So with all that said, enjoying the foods, lots of greens, uh, lots of good type, high quality plant-based food, but also not so worried if I tend to have more meat than I would normally would. What are the things that you do when you're away from home? Is it something that uh, you want to do very soon? And do you have any tricks that you may play in this game of still losing weight while being away from home? I thank you so much for watching. And don't forget that caregiving begins with you, but also more importantly, you always must keep searching for the perfect bite and balance. Thanks again. Bye.